My 36M husband wants me to blindly trust him 33F after he cheated on me. My husband and I have been married for four years and we have a son. Our relationship hasn't been good lately. We didn't fight, but he would ignore me. He would tell me he wants to unwind after work so don't talk to him and he wouldn't even respond when I said good morning or tried to talk to him in the morning. It was like I was invisible. A week ago I found out that he's been cheating on me because a friend of mine saw him with another woman in the park kissing. My husband admitted it's been going on for a year and that it's his coworker. He did say he wants to work on our marriage and I agreed. However he has not been more engaging and ignores me just like before. Last night he saw me crying and he told me I should trust him since we've both committed to a new start. But how can I blindly trust him if he's still ignoring me? He told me I should trust him since we've both committed to a new start. No. What he means is leave me alone so I can go duck whomever I want while you stay home and be the official woman. He might even use your son as a tool for that, and it don't nag me in front of the child, you wouldn't want him to hate us? Wait. Look. You can try couples counseling like another person said. But the truth is that your husband has been lying to you for at least a year, and has been cheating on you with at least one woman. For at least a year, he's been making the conscious decision to choose another over the woman he promised to be his number one. He's been consciously choosing to leave both his wife and his son behind to get his dick wet. Think about that and you'll see how little he cares about and respects you both. Do you want that kind of man in your and your son's life as a role model? He doesn't show interest in you or your relationship, and you can't force him to do it either would you even be satisfied at all if you forced him into staying with you when he was making it clear he wants the opposite. My advice would be to get your support system in place family, friends and talk to a lawyer to see what options you have to separate from this man. What is there to trust? Being upset that he's treating you badly isn't about trust. You could trust him 100% although I would not, since you know he's untrustworthy, and you still would have every reason to have a problem with him treating you badly. So, he both should earn back your trust and tell you his plan for fixing the relationship. If he doesn't have one, then he's not serious about doing so. The problem is when I talk to him, he acts like I didn't say anything and just ignores me. It's almost impossible to have a conversation with him. Then he has stopped having a relationship with you, and he simply has not made it official. I suggest you make the breakup official and start moving on. Since you are married, you should probably talk to a lawyer first. He has no interest in this marriage, but he's very much interested in not having to go through a divorce. Please, please respect yourself and leave. There is no marriage left to work on, he just wants you to sit down, Shut up and let him continue to sleep with his co-worker. Do you want your son growing up to think this is an acceptable way to treat a partner? Your husband is not committed to you or your marriage. I'd say go to couples counseling, but I think you responded to another comment saying he won't. If he won't commit to couples counseling, he's not interested in fixing the relationship. Leave him. You and your son deserve so much better. A cheater loses all rights to privacy if they want you to trust them again. Read Leave the Cheater, Gain a Life, The Chump Lady's Survival Guide. It's exactly what you need. Thank you. What stops me leaving is my son. My husband is usually gone all weekend and my son asks for him. I feel like he's too young to have to go through this. So your husband was caught cheating. He didn't come to you and tell you. What remorse has your husband shown? What has he done to reconcile? How do you know the affair is finished? Did you tell his AP's partner? I could be reading between the lines but your husband's affair is still active. He has not shown full remorse and done nothing to reconcile. Your husband is not interested in you except as a housewife and mother. He can't bear to talk to you. He has no interest in you. I bet he still works with his lover. What boundaries have you set for him and is he complying? 
You do not deserve this. Get your finances sorted and see a lawyer then blindside him with a divorce. You don't have a marriage or husband except in name. You don't deserve this anguish he has and is causing you. Seek help from friends and family. Trust is earned. He is actively cheating and has shattered any trust you had in him. He's putting no effort into saving the marriage. I suspect he's playing for time so he can get assets hidden and all set up for life with the new woman. Call a lawyer, call it quits and move forward with your life. He is going to have to earn back your trust and doesn't get to set a timeline on it or have expectations about when you should get over it. If he's still ignoring you and trying to rug sweep then I wouldn't trust him either. He never stopped cheating on you, and you know that. Now you have to decide what's best for you and your son. Do you want your kid to grow up and witness a loveless marriage where his mom tolerates cheating, lying and ignorance and learn from that? Do you want to stay in this marriage? He isn't going to change, so throw that idea out the window and ask yourself if you can stay in a marriage that you have right now because that's what he wants. When he said he wants to work on the marriage, he obviously meant I want to keep this thing we have without having to actually take responsibility for my actions or even change anything because I'm having lots of fun this way, his actions clearly show that. It's up to you. Trust isn't blind. It's experience. You're going to have to have a long talk about what you need from him. Maybe he can't give it. You then have to decide if you're willing to live with that. But how can I blindly trust him if he's still ignoring me? You can't. He knows you can't. He's almost 40. He's not some teenager. Stop thinking that he doesn't understand. He understands. He wants you to go along with what he wants anyway. You are holding on to a man who cheated on you for a year, admitted it only when he was caught, and ignores you. He's still ignoring you after saying that he'd work on the marriage with you. I'm sorry. This is breaking my heart for you, but it's obvious that he's checked out. He wants to have his cake and eat it too, and you're letting him. This is not the kind of relationship you deserve. This isn't even a relationship at all, if he's not speaking to you. Get tested for STDs because who knows what he's exposed you to, and if I were you, I would talk to a divorce attorney. If you aren't ready to do that yet, I completely understand, but that means, I talk to a therapist alone, because you need to figure out if this is really a relationship worth saving, if this is even a relationship that can be saved.